Howdy folks, this is Checkers, back again with another episode of Checkers of the Khajiit Goes to the Elder Scrolls Online Elsewhere, this time with episode 16, and we are here in the Scar with Zamarak, and I will turn it over now to Checkers of the Khajiit, or oh, Dragon Goes. Okay, we go. Where is Zamarak to go? We go here. Below, track down assassination squad. Beetle? So much going on. You are safe for now, butterfly. Still going below, yes, yeah, still? Look like the right place. Turn left at the scorpions. You really want to go that way, scorpion? Or you want to live for the next few minutes? Same uh, offer for you, harpy. Track down assassination squad. Well, terror boards. Wait, the body. It's one of the assassins. They must have passed this way. Okay, well, he apparently made good board food. More bodies. The hired guides. Saulinia's work, Samarak thinks. Well... Don't want to leave witnesses, yes? Okay. Look, there is a door behind these stones. Is this the place we seek? We go. Doval Shrine. Okay. We are in. Search the hidden shrine. Whoa. Whoa, such a place. Such a place, Amrak. There is some kind... What is that swirling over there? That door, Examine the stone pedestal. All of Zamarak's strength and training can budge a magical barrier. Maybe the pedestal. The pedestal maintains the magical barrier, but Zamarak does not know how. Find the dragon guard, or his blood won't be the only thing that stains my blade this day. The assassins. They stalk the southern passages. We must hurry. There may be another way past this door, deeper in the complex. Shouldn't we try to open this one? Whatever has been hiding behind that door for all these years can wait a little longer. We need to deal with the assassins. They are the most pressing threat. That shout we heard. Saulinia and her killers must be close. Okay, we go. Someone knows how to use door. Okay, we go. Butterflies have reprieve for now. Yes, this stone does not look, uh... Samarak, please don't step on this stone. Traps! They stopped some of the assassins, but not all of them. We must be wary. Yes, the brightly colored stones are good indication. Samarak? Which part of the brightly colored stones did you not get? Okay. What does this say here? Fear the foe, heed the teacher. Edu iwat pir pikra natsi vrin. Pause of the adamant, voice of the end, fear the foe, heed the teacher. Move as wind, bend as river. Before victory, there is survival. Hate, injury, shun, death. Edu iwat pikra. Nazi Vrin. 
Okay. Oh, you know, that had that one fair and square. Well done, Samarak. Here is something also. Gone from sainted memory. Telco an Vruj Tian. The peace once known gone from sainted memory. The lessons of great agony. Wisdom from behind the stars. We must learn or we must die. Telco an Vruj Tian. Okay. Alrighty then. Just little Khajiit humor there. Devastation is the scream. Meek one all fell tet brinup. No talon, no tail, no fang. Devastation is the scream. To Sunderstone and armies, keep silence with our foe. Let the shout die in the throat. Meek one all fell tet brinup. Maybe this way. Okay. You can't hide from us forever, Dragon Guard. You couldn't find an Alfreak in Alabaster, you Roxian dolt. That was the Dragon Guard. We're running out of Journey to endings. Uf Hian Jonri Isector. Seek blessings, grant pardons. Journey to endings. No return for we soldier hunter pilgrim. Soul and mind falter. Uf Hian Jonri Isector. Okay, where we go? This way? That way? I think this way. Unless we have just come back to where we came in. Another no. maze. We must find a way to the other side. Okay, we need to go sneaking though. What we have here? Gifts of death and fear. Ilok fa ohush zirit xen. All Dragon Guard remember gifts of death and fear. Our foes, endless and proud, cannot think as we. Only of gain, never loss. Ilok fa ohush zirit ksen. Okay, we go. Balista of some kind. Whoa. Wait, wait, what we have here? Fight as prey. Ret Ashtu Zin Fong Dan Lo. Forget honor as dragons do. Instead, fight as prey. Run and hide. Strike from ambush. Wound with a thousand cuts. Deceit triumphs over pride. Ret Ashtu Zin Fong Dan Lo. Oh, that was not, not good. Oh, 
Oh, you know... Do not take fun from Kaji. Kingdoms fall, people wander. Norfa in Vit Kel Usok. No faith outside brethren. Kingdoms fall, people wander. Our vigil without end. Longer than walls can stand, stronger than thrones. Norfa in Vit Kel Usok. Okay. Well, Zamarak, we go. Once I select a target, it always dies. I trained to fight dragons. This isn't going to end the way you expect. Okay, what we have here is death the promise. Net zan ur gendrai tsoli. An end comes to all. In death is the promise. Battle weary sword laid down. Battle scarred shield set aside. All shall rest in lasting peace. Net zan ur gendrai tsoli. Oh. I refuse to die. Okay, that is good. Maybe now the royal family can rest in peace. Dragon God Orland. Oh, damn assassin. She knew her stuff. I saw her fall, though. Thanks for that. After all these years, why do I suddenly have so much company? Dragons have returned. Euroxia sent the assassin because she thought you knew how to stop them. I know about the dragons. I sent word to the other sanctuaries. Other sanctuaries? I th this one thought you were the last dragon guard. The last? I didn't think so. But no one else has responded. Maybe. No. I know at least one other is still out there. He'll come. He has to. Is there really a way to stop the dragons? Take my ring. It will open the sanctuary. Find the dragon horn. You have to. Have to. Dragon guard Orland. May Kenarthi guide you to the sands behind the stars. Okay, well. Open the dragon guard sanctuary. Below. That looks like Prefect Kalo. What is he doing here? Not sure. We go. What you are doing, Kalo? Ah, there you are. We came as soon as we could. Were you able to stop Captain Salinia and her assassins? Salinia is dead, but so is the Dragon Guard. Did Kamira accept terms of your alliance? Both dead? Selenia deserved it. Shame about the Dragon Guard, though. And yes, it took some convincing and Tharn's most diplomatic negotiation tactics, but Queen Chimera has accepted our help. Provisionally. Provisionally? The Cygnus Irregulars are on probation. For now. Once Queen Chimera sees us in action, I'm sure she'll come around. Until then, I wanted to make sure you were all right. Beating Selenia is no small feat. I'm sorry we lost the Dragon Guard, though. The Dragon Guard gave me a key to his sanctuary. We were on our way to retrieve a Dragon Horn. A Dragon Horn? Like the one at Starhaven Adaptorium? Huh. Well, if you think this old relic can help, lead the way. Okay. Okay, insert ring into... The barrier has fallen.
Doval Sanctuary. Are these Whoa. the remains of the Dragon Guard? This is quite possible. So many books. books scrolls. I knew it. Knowledge is power, my friend. You'll see. And there is much knowledge in this place. What what was this? Oh, seed. But cabinets do not work. Urn is empty. Well, you know they were set for wine. Couple of more uh, tablets. Oh, much place to sleep for people. But no containers to search. And no books to read. For the old of Akavir. Hewa Okush. Sandrita, no faith in blade or shield for the old of Akavir, the song of our first brethren, a weapon for when the dragon, for when the need arises, the anequina dragon horn. Hewa Okush Zandrita. Same thing. Okay, oh look, here is Oh, there is big maybe and little. Enequina combat dragon horn. Such a small thing when compared to the dragons. Still, we should take it to Rimen, yes? Okay, return to Rimen Palace. Such a place. I want to take another look at these books. We'll meet you back in Rimen. Okay, you guys both stay here. Zamarak sure. will linger as well. To make sure the Imperials find their way back. Okay. You go, Zamarak. Or, well, you know, stay. Okay. We will... Go where does this lead? Out to elsewhere. We will fast travel to Remen. We'll be there when we step outside. It's happening again, I see. What? I, I see a dragon. Cadwell? Cadwell. What was that about a dragon? Ah, there you are. See to Cadwell, if you would. Then join us in the throne room for the war council. Okay. Uh, hello? Is is someone there? I appear to be back in my head. Well, the, the, the... My other head. The other head. This is so confusing. Ah, wait, wait. Things are becoming clearer now. Ah, uh, yes, well, uh... There you are. Oh! So good to see you again, my friend. Godwell, what did you see? I saw that nasty orc necromancer, Zumog Foom. He really is a despicable fellow. And there was a dragon, a huge, powerful, eyes as big as a house dragon. They called it Karl Grunted, means champion of the bound time. How do I know these things? Did you see or hear anything else? Well, yes, I did. Seems the ears are as connected as the eyes. They talked about the moons, something about an eclipse and the perfect time to use the gate. I remember something about that from when I was the betrayer, but the details are hazy. Your memories of your life are returning? My memory returns in dribs and drabs, but I'm not sure that's a good thing. If I remember anything healthful, though, I'll let you know. Where are my manners? They're waiting for you. Queen Kamira has called another war council in the throne room. Do you know what the war council is meeting about? Not a clue, but I know one way to find out. 
Head inside and see what the cat queen has to say. Okay. Goodbye, Cadwell. Okay, we go. Remen Palace Throne Room. The archives were extremely helpful once I found the appropriate documents. Our moon singers and moon priests have always paid particular attention to detail. What did you learn? Farn found documents regarding an ancient agreement with the Dragon Guard. They apparently provided a weapon to use against the dragons. This relates to the legends of Kunsari and Queen Anequina, yes? Pardon the interruption, Queen Chimera. But that sounds like the dragon horn we found. That dragon guard didn't survive, but he gave us the Anequina dragon horn. <sighs> so this alliance I reluctantly agreed to has borne fruit. The Cygnus irregulars assisted, but your agent did the important work. A weapon from the dragon guard. Interesting. Come, Five Claw. I want to hear your report. Agreeing to an alliance with Imperials. At least it appears this Prefect Kalo assisted you. Tell me what happened out there, Five Claw. I want to hear it from you. The assassin killed the Dragon Guard, but we did acquire the Anequina Dragon Horn. So that is the Dragon Horn. It is much smaller than I thought it would be, and it looks fragile. Sound it once and it will probably crumble to dust. What are we supposed to do with such a thing? As always, you have my thanks, Five Claw. Yes, my queen. Euraxia hoped to appease the dragons by assassinating the last dragon guard of elsewhere. He died. But at least you acquired the Anequina dragon horn and avenged his death. Now, if we only knew what to do with the damn thing. It makes noise, like any other horn, yes? I know how a horn works, Five Claw. But this is a relic of ancient magic. I do not want to damage it before we learn the true significance of its power. I will have Tarn do more research. In the meantime, we have another matter to deal with. Another matter? Cadwell's visions strike more frequently now. With more urgency. Tarn believes Zumag Fum is close to reassembling Cadwell's dismembered body. I want you to stop him. The betrayer of legend must not be reborn. This one will find Zumag Fum and stop him from reassembling Cadwell, the betrayer. Abner Tarn checks on Cadwell regularly. Find them and see if they can tell you where Zumag Fum hides. Meanwhile, I will consult with Garish Lee. Review the Kunzari stories before we task Tarn with learning more about the Dragon Horn. You must know something about this horn, no? A little. There was a similar relic at Starhaven Adeptorium, but I never gave it much thought. It was just there, another memento of a mostly forgotten past. The one you brought us. It bears the name of an Equina. What's the significance of an Equina? An Equina is the name of our kingdom, the northern half of Elsewhere. It grew out of one of the 16 original prides and was named after my ancestor, an Equina Sharptongue. She was one of the ancient heroes, a member of Kunzari's Krajan. Do you think this really has something to do with the legends of Kunzari? Legends and myths make up a great part of who we are, Five Claw. For the Khajiit, the truth of our stories is the truth, pure and simple. The return of the dragons began with the tales of Kunzari, and I expect it to end there as well. Do you think the dragon horn is also part of this story? No. Kunzari and his company of heroes predate the arrival of the Akaviri and Tamriel. It was the Akaviri who gave rise to the Dragon Guard and revealed the secrets of the Dragon Horn. As I understand it, the Starhaven Dragon Horn was a gift. A gift? From the ancient order of the Dragon Guard, if I remember what the adept at Starhaven once told me. I assume the same is true of the Anequina Dragon Horn. It's too bad that the Dragon Guard you met did not live long enough to tell you more. Okay, goodbye.
Abnur Tarn. Where we find Abnur Tarn? Okay. Okay, Abnur Tarn. You are this way. We go. Uh oh. This is not good. Don't you dare attach that foot to my ankle. This is Cadwell's longest episode yet. Perhaps I can... That's it! Time to give you knaves what for! These are visions. Dismembered bodies. I hate necromancy. Cadwell trusts you, Five Claw. You talk to him. Cadwell. Who's there? Speak up! I'm about to teach these rapscallions a valuable lesson. And yes, I plan to make it hurt. Cadwell. It is, it is this one, it's Checkers. What's going on? Ah, jolly good. I could use a noble squire for the battle ahead, to battle Ahab. Anyway, uh, Zumok Fu has gathered the dismembered parts of the betrayer's body. I can't allow the necromancer to put him, me, back together. Godwell, what are you seeing? Where is Zumog Fum? I'm not entirely certain. It's definitely a dark, menacing cavern. Just the sort of place necromancers enjoy hanging around. Oh! Here now! Stop that! Uh, your pardon, noble squire, but I have to go kick myself in the head. Godwell, wait! I'm off to put a stop to these dastardly villains! Tarn, can you determine where Cadwell disappeared to? Of all the foolish, idiotic, misguided things that Cadwell has ever done, this may be the worst of them all. He fancies himself a hero, but he's given Zumog Fum exactly what he needed. What do you mean? What does Zumog Fum need from Cadwell? I'm no expert on necromancy, but it's obvious that our Cadwell is the last piece Zumog Fum needs to restore the betrayer. He has all the parts of Cadwell's dismembered body, and now Cadwell has handed him the final component. His very essence. His essence? You mean his soul? Does a soul shriven have a soul? I have no idea how the philosophy of oblivion accounts for such things, but there must be some kernel of the original Cadwell inside the one we know. It stands to reason. The necromancer would need that as well. How do we help Cadwell? We don't even know where he went. I managed to scry Cadwell's portal before it winked out. It connected to an ancient crypt in the Scar, not far from the Stitches. Head there immediately. The rest of us will make preparations and join you as soon as we can. This one will find Zumog Fum's lair in the Scar and meet you there. Okay, but not that way apparently. Don't mind me just checking for um, seditious materials from Diraxians and things. Like this maple shield. Okay. So. Well, we'll end journey for now here. Maybe take a moment. And we'll continue again next time. For the moment, this one would like to say thank you so much for joining on journey. Hope you found it entertaining and maybe even just a little bit informative. Would also like to invite you to subscribe to Checkers the Human and thank you kindly if you are already subscribed. Would also like to ask you to like and share if you so desire. Most of all though, would like to ask you to please, please take care.